uh, you need to know people let's just write off one extra word on the treatment also okay for pediatrics so if there is a seizure you will uh, check airway breathing circulation then you will take blood and check for glucose calcium magnesium liver function test renal function test a complete blood count you'll check for toxins because now you know the reasons for the epilepsy right so you will check all this then you will give lorazepam or midazolam this is what you should have handy suddenly you will give what lorazepam midazolam how much 0.1 mg per kg at least this uh, you try to remember the dose everything else has dose which we are not going to try to remember as of now up to two, two doses you can give this 5 minutes apart okay then if this guy has hypoglycemia then you give glucose okay then if seizure continues then give uh, phenytoin or phosphenytoin sodium valproate lev Levi, Levi T. Racetam, okay, Levi T. Racetam you give, then you try phenobarbiton, midozolam, okay, none of these are working, see everything, everything you're giving sequentially, you're not giving everything, you're giving one by one after the other, waiting for it to improve, the condition to improve, then you will, if nothing works, finally, coma induced by phenobarbiton, orthopentone or propofol, these two are what, anesthetic agents, ketamine also anesthetic, right, and uh, uh, oral topiramid, they are saying you can consider. What you should understand is this is the only thing that is oral here. Everything was IV only, right? And one more thing you notice here, midazolam is sitting at the end and it is sitting in the first also. Both the places it is sitting before the induced coma. Interesting, right? And finally, after everything subsides, subsides looks like they are trying immunotherapy, vagal nerve stimulation, some device to or some stimulate the vagal nerve so the body will calm down, is it? Dietary therapy, epilepsy, surgery. Finally, they're thinking about surgery. Okay, guys, so now it's time to tell what will you do if there is a child with seizures. Yes, come on. Airway breathing, circulation, blood test. Very good, very good. Then um, I will give lorazepam. Yes, midazolam. Very good. 0.1 mg per kg. Very good. Lorazepam or midazolam. Yes, then doesn't work. Then phenytoin, phosphenytoin. Very good. Sodium valproate. Very good. Then then leviti racetam. Yeah, leviti racetam. Very good. After that, I know last is medazolam, very good. Before that, you're missing something. Phenobarbiton, where did we give? Did we give phenobarbiton? Yes, very good. So you got all the drugs, right? And then after all this, you will induce a coma with phenobarbiton or some anesthetics. Okay, and after all this, they're trying some immunotherapy, vagal nerve stimulation, dietary therapy, therapy epilepsy, surgery, etc. So did you understand, guys, in the entire pediatrics, whatever you have to know, neonatal seizures we covered. Then we covered seizures beyond new newborn period. We covered how do you manage status epilepticus, etc.